Hello, welcome to another Kuala in the Basement video. Uh, it's been a long time since I've uploaded a video, I believe about six months. Um, as you can see, a decent amount has changed in my life. Um, and uh, this video is not about that. I'm not gonna get into all the details of that. That'll be for another video. Um, but uh, I'll definitely upload that at another time, sometime very soon. Um, today will be about a game that I like. Uh, today will be about a game that I like um, quite a bit, uh, Magic the Gathering. Um, this channel has primarily focused on trading cards, like Pokemon trading cards, but my first ever card game that I really got into was Magic the Gathering, and um, I later on started collecting Pokemon cards. Now, I'm not a huge Magic collector per se, I'm more so a player, um, but I also collect it as well. I have I have a pretty big collection. Um, now, today we'll be opening a brand new Magic the Gathering product. I have here a sealed case of the new Modern Horizons 3 set. These are collector boosters. Now, I'm not going to open the entire case. Um, we'll see. We'll see how fun it is. We'll see that, that sort of thing. Um, but I will at least open one box on this video. <laughs> And so we're gonna get right into that. All right, so now the audio quality on this video may not be as good as typically, as it typically is in, um, in my other videos. Um, there we go. Now, like I said, the audio quality may not be that great, and that is because some things have changed and I don't have everything set up quite yet. But, um, we will have it set up. And take a look at this. Oh yeah, oh it's beautiful. Okay. Alright, let's crack one of these guys. So I'm gonna pick one of these guys out of the box. Um, let's go with this guy right here. Let's grab one of these boys. Beauty, absolute beauty. All right, so let's get started. Let's open this back way right up. Cool. All right, so yeah, like I said, needless to say, I'm very excited. Get these guys out here, and uh, very pretty, very nice boosters. Um, as always, you know, Magic. Uh, Magic's been around for a long time. They're the they're the OGs, I believe. Um, so they probably know how to make a good product. Um, oh, let me pull up my list of cards I need to care about. Ulmog, Emrakul. Yeah, the typical guys should be. Good. Kozilek, Emrakul, Ugin's Labyrinth, Ulamog, Ajani, Tamiyo. Okay, cool. Alright, so, without further ado, let's get into it. Um, zombie, hollow zombie token off the, off the bat. So that was the back of the pack? Okay, so these are the commons. So, um, it's a little difficult for my, the way I have things set up here for me to properly face the camera the whole time. Okay, so these are the uncommons. Wow, the whole thing is foil, interesting. Every single card is foil, is that how that works? Uh, well, I'm assuming not the, uh, oh, this is a nice full art planes, look at that. Meltdown, then we have Jolted Awake, then we have a Guide of Souls, we have this here, Lazotep Query, Ruby Medallion, and a Volatile Stormdrake Hollow. 
Very cool. Very, very cool indeed. So let's make two little piles here for those. Um, I want to sit here and read through a lot of these because I'm interested to see, you know, what some of these cards do or how powerful they are. And obviously, of course, to take, take a second and price out some of the cards, but I'll just do that afterwards when I'm editing the video and getting ready to upload it. But. So I guess I could take some of this. Uh, so it looks like, yeah, I don't know. So this is the beginning. Okay, so this is the back. Okay, so it like opens weirdly. So I was opening it from the back. I guess that makes sense. Um, so I, I guess I could talk about how I ended up here with a big beard <laughs> and um, in a different room than my previous, um, that's a beautiful forest, evolution witness. I, like these cards in the back are kind of random. Like, so this one's an uncommon, this one's a, uh, a rare. Oh, okay. Already a nice hit, Ulek. Very nice. He's definitely a, definitely a cool card here. Let's put him to the side. Harbinger of the Seas. Oh, I revealed one extra. Psych Frog, Pearl Ear, Imperial Advisor, and the Phyrexian Germ Token. Very cool, very cool. So, um, yeah, like I was saying, how I ended up here. Uh, if some of you are subscribed to my channel and have watched, um, have watched my previous video of my home remodeling, um, I'm opening from the back, so I guess the front, that makes sense that the front is here, yeah. So, I renovated this place that I'm in right now. Um, it was pretty fun. At first, it wasn't. At first, I was like, I don't want to do this. Um, you know, this is not something I want to be a part of, but as the project went on, it got more and more fun. It got more and more interesting because we saw, I saw results rather, you know, um, monstrous vortex. Oh, consuming corruption. And then we got an, Ooh, we got a foil Ugin's labyrinth. Wow. Beautiful. Okay. Let's see what else we got here. Chittering dispatcher, wooded foothills, six. And then we got the the token. Okay, that Ugin's Labyrinth foil is nice, very nice. So, I renovated this home with my dad and a family friend, a couple family friends, you could say. And it's um, it's something I had never uh, tried to attempt before in my life, um, and I can say with great pleasure that it managed to turn out pretty great. And um, this this home is amazing. I love this home. I'll do a little tour. Um, and I also had another little baby. I have a three month old baby now. Um, and so I just haven't had the time to, snow covered waste, um, to really um, dream tide whale. Tarmogoyf's Nest. Chantland has one. Create a Tarmogoyf token. Okay, that's kind of weird. Necro Bloom. That looks cool. Another Wooded Foothills. And then we got Disruptor Flute. And a Servo. I don't know what that is. Yeah, the, the home turned out amazing. I had another little baby. I haven't had the opportunity to really um, sit down and make content, make YouTube videos, um, so I guess for me, um, this is a little bit of a, little, little bit of a comeback, you could say, right? A little bit of a comeback onto the scene. Um, now, I'm not a big creator by any means, and I didn't have a particularly robust catalog of videos, so... It's not like it affected my life in, in a particularly negative way not to make videos for some time. Although I did enjoy making them, so um, I guess it's nice to be back. It's nice to be back. Definitely, definitely nice to be back. And there's Sapphire Medallion, okay. And we have this guy, Recruiter of the Guard, Wheel of Potential. Oh, 
fluffy spa. It's, uh, it's definitely nice to be back. Um, and I think this box opening could end up being a very good box opening simply because it's a sort of um, returning video. So maybe I'll have some sort of extra luck. Look, see? The Tamiyo, the Tamiyo foil token. Let's go. Oh, Cranial Ram, this was already pre-banned. Deceptive Landscape, Kami of Jealous Thirst, Utter Insignificance, Tamiyo means blah, 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 Charitable, The Swamp, Spill our Ember Mage, and then let's go here, Unholy Heat, Flare of Duplication, Benthic Anomaly, Anomaly, Arena of Glory, Flare of Denial Ford. Oh! <laughs> okay, all right. What a box. Oh, and there's another card in the back. Okay, that's just the... very amazing. Um, that's really, <laughs> that's awesome. Okay, so here we got uh, those two there. Uh, let's keep going, shall we? Uh, we got a lot to get through here. So the Ajani was a little bit of a false false alarm. Um, but we still have a few packs left in this box, and uh, our goal here is to uh, is to hit a number that uh, allows us to at least break even. Uh, I know that a lot of people are talking about pre-order pricing um, being on the higher side, slightly higher side. Oh, this, this insect token got on. Kind of got that insect token. Okay, um, so let's just get through these writing. Chrysalis, Sage of the Noble, Solstice, Proud Pack Rhino, uh, Royal Cartographer, Sundering Eruption, and then let's go into Forest. Oh, the prints on this. Unholy Heat. Wait, something, something, something's looking good there. I don't know what card that is. Maybe if someone has opened these or someone knows better than me. Maybe they are more excited for me than I am, because I have no idea what, what that card is going to be. There's a Winter Moon. There's Kudo, King Among Bears. <laughs> That's a cool card. Very interesting. Okay. And then we have a Strix Serenade. I don't know if that's good or not. Um, but yeah, we got it. I'm assuming it's not since I don't see it in my list of things that I care about. So, looks like we got one, two, three, four, five packs left. So, let's keep it going. Let's hopefully get something good. Okay. Alright, so, Downyard Lurker, Refurbished Familiar, Mandibular Kite. Colossal Dread Mask, Causalex, Unsealing, Wirewood Symbiote, Revitalizing the Past, Planes, Grim Servant, Evolution Witness, then we have a Cursed Mirror, an Angelic Aberration, Invert Polarity, and then we have a Party Thrasher, the Raw Moon Sage, Moonsoon, Monsoon Mage, sorry, I don't know why. Um, that's pretty cool, and so that's going to be the reverse. Very nice. Raw. Ral. Leyline Prodigy. The Monsoon Mage. Very cool. I'll throw this over here. Um, hopefully, we can pull a serialized card on the first box, right guys? That's how that works, right? Hmm. Ding on this. I can't see. Yeah, I have no idea. So maybe I should be more careful. I don't know if I'm opening them wrong. I've been opening Pokemon for so long that I'm not sure <laughs> if there's something I'm uh, missing on this. And I'm trying not to let the glare get in the way of the card art. Fledgling Dragon. There's something being revealed back here. <laughs> I keep doing that. Um... 
snow covered wastes and we got a dragon rage channeler not do winged wisdom i know i've seen the far art a full art of his oh omo queen of vesuva this is a pretty um pretty sought after card um i know this is pretty good i don't think it's particularly expensive but oh this is a very cool six right here and then we have amphibian downpour and a emerald medallion that's a cool six let's throw that in the pile of things maybe the Elmo. three packs left three packs left um let's do this let's do this let's do this oh, hold on. Try not to push too much on the packs. Apparently some of these cards are very sensitive. So I gotta make sure that I'm uh, being very careful because I kind of bent my little um, token card. Demon Inferior, Horrid Shadow Spinner, Reiterating Bolt, Angel of Ruins, Beautiful Plains, Full Art. Um, and then we have it that heralds the end. That's an interesting artwork. Can't really, there you go. Huh, I don't even know what's going on in there. Skoa Ember Mage, a truce appropriation. Then we got K Famed Mechanist, that's kind of not great. And we have Echoes of Eternity. Oh, we have another Rawl Monsoon Mage, non hollow. Or non foil, the Necro Bloom. And then we have a token, sort of a token. Two packs left. Let's see what we end up getting here. I'm not sure how it works in terms of consistencies amongst um, sealed products when it comes to magic. Uh, in, in Pokemon, oftentimes, if you have a case, especially Japanese, you're kind of guaranteed a certain number of hits. Um, I'm not sure if it works like that with magic, especially with these collector boosters. I don't know if they're particularly seeded, right? Like, I don't know if the actual, oh, I don't know if the seeding um, is sort of, okay, sorry. Um, I don't know if it's predetermined, right? Like, maybe not predetermined, but I don't know if it's as formulaic, right? So, like, if I don't get a particular hit or if I... If I don't, um, there's no, there's no like certain stipulations that are met to, oh, okay, you, you pulled the SR, you pulled the SAR or something like that. Like you can't get anything else anymore. You know, that sort of thing. Null Elemental Blast, Winter Moon, Inversion Behemoth, a Bloodstained Mire Full Art, a Kappa Cannoneer, Weight of the Reliquary, and a Phyrexian Germ. So, upcoming, coming up is going to be the last pack. This is the last pack that I'll be doing. So, wish me luck. Um, thank you guys for watching. And uh, let's get into this last pack magic here. Hopefully, we pull something absolutely wild, like a serialized card. Um, no guarantees, though. The print run, some of these things in the back. I don't know if it's like bouncing around in the box. There's no way I did that. It's like slight um, in perspective. Oh, that's a really cool artwork. Glimpse the Impossible. Very cool, very cool. All right, let's go. Tempest Harvester, Monstrous Vortex, Amped uh, Raptor, Junk Diver, Beautiful Mountain. All right, first, got this Brain Surge vintage looking border. Charitable Levy, okay, Kappa Cannoneer, okay, Selective Obliteration, then we have a Lila the Blade Reforged, a um, Chthonian Nightmare, uh, and then Ulmog the Defiler in the Retro Frame, wow, wow, Last Pack Magic, guys, look at that. Look at that, incredible. That's some incredible artwork, guys, and a really nice pull. Really nice pull to round this box off. Um, I'll have to double check the pricing on some of these and see where we ended up value-wise. 
Um, but it's looking to be a pretty, you know, decent box. Um, the Ajani, the Ololank, the Olamog, um, the Ugin's Labyrinth foil. A lot of decent hits, a lot of good hits. Uh, I mean, no serialized cards, but uh, hey, that's how it goes sometimes. Apparently, they're extremely rare. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. Anyway, that was cool. That was fun. I enjoyed that quite a bit. Um, it might be difficult for me to contain myself and not try to open the rest of this booster case. Um, but um, we'll see how it goes. We'll see. We'll see if I can control the urge to rip the rest of these boxes. I think there's a good amount of value in these, uh, which is part of the reason why I picked them up. And I am selling them, by the way. Um, I have cases available for sale. I have cases and boxes available for sale. Um, so let me know, guys, if you're interested in this product. I, I can get this uh, get this out to you guys. Uh, today's the release day. Um, so, uh, and I, I just got this in yesterday or the day before. And uh, yeah, so just let me know. Um, shoot me a message. Um, you can check it out on my online store. Check it out in the, the description below. And as always, thank you for watching. And until next time, peace.